Hello and welcome. It's Saturday the 22nd of January and we're going to see if we can actually get into Ultimate Team first time or if it's going to be another one of these. Uh, oh, here okay. Obviously we know those attackers are in the team for the next 23 hours and 58 minutes. So basically this time tomorrow they will move on to midfielders. So... So have a look. We're expecting upgrades today and probably another flashback. Uh, knowing them this time, I don't think we'll get objectives or anything like that. And it doesn't look like it either. Nearly completed the messy objectives. Nearly completed the moments verde. And let's have a look, see where we are at the moment. Lewandowski is ahead of Messi at the moment. They're just calling them Robert and then Lionel Messi, it seems. Um, so let's check our SBCs, see what we have. Right, live. Okay, we have a moment. Lucas Paqueta celebrating his superb build up and goal against Claremont in the league this season. Fair enough. So he's five star skill moves, only a three star weak foot, but that dribbling stat is looking lovely. Let's have a. There you go. Pretty evenly balanced dribbling. That's a really good card. I don't know what you put on it. Maybe a hawk, maybe an engine. You'd have to touch the pace a little bit, unfortunately. Which makes me think engine probably would be the right one. Flair, outside the foot shot trait, so it's a nice card for an 88 rated. Ooh, an 81 plus attacker upgrade. It's not repeatable. That's weird. So it's, you just swap in a squad like the previous upgrade to get an 81 attacker. Let's have a look at this one first. 84, an 85, and an 86 with two team of the weeks. I mean, it's a decent card. Already got quite a lot of Liga 1 midfielders, so I probably won't do this straight off the bat. Unless duplic duplicates transpire otherwise, and I'm forced to do some sort of SPC. So, oh, it's, oh, it's 11 players. Okay. This is could be expensive. 11 attackers rated 81 or higher. That That's going to be a price and a half. Surely. Let's have a look at this. See where we are. 83. Eight, no, 85. 86. 84 is good. An 84 rated squad when you're getting 11, 81 plus his back is really good. And a team of the year challenge. So let's get rid of the Premier League. And see if these three are the only three new things. So, 84 rated squad with 70 chem. Can I do this straight off the bat? Let's see if I can. Should have enough here. By keeping them all the same league and maxing out your chances of keeping the chemistry high. Let's see if I need another 84. So we need to up it by a couple there we go I'm not going to use any of those players again so that's all good good thing about saving the packs like I did the hundred odd packs where I didn't get any team of the years unfortunately means you just have a whole load of bump that you can put into other things um, that make it slightly easier so this is a flash SP oh two days rather than two hours okay Team of the Year Challenge, number one, a rare Electrum Players Pack. It's a 75 rated squad with 90 games, six rare players, so silvers and golds, basically. Minimum four countries, maximum of six players are in the same league. So you can do six from the same league and then four from another, five from another league and you'll be 
fine. That's fairly straightforward to do. And Lucas Paqueta being the other favourite thing. So have we got anything else going on? Base and mid player pick is still there. Team Leader is still there. Aubameyang is still there. Sterling is still there. No new icons, I'd imagine. No, nothing there either. So let's see if we've got any preview promo packs at all. And then we'll open the 11 plus attackers one. Let's see what happens there. So there's my Premier League, my 83s. Where's my 11? There we go. So they're all the normal attacker positions. Uh, no preview promo packs at all. Got hours left on those, so we'll just leave that all there. Right, so store, let's open that pack. Really hoping for a blue flare, but as you can see, I've only got midfielders and defenders left other than this. So let's have a look at this. 11 of them. I'm anticipating, I'm going to guess, 84 high. Actually, I just put an Iago Aspas in, so I reckon I'm going to get an Iago Aspas out. That does happen more often than FIFA would actually. Oh, we go. We've got lots of flares. That's in my insignia. Lovely. I swear I put him in something recently. 86 high is more than I expected, to be honest. And we got a million and one duplicates. The lovely thing is, because they're 81s, they're 10 to a penny anyway, so it doesn't really matter about getting rid of them. The other ones I'll just have to put into an SBC somewhere. There really is nothing tradable there. Ace. So there you go. Got the Aspas that I expected. Insigne, Tadic and Kramaric. So I'll have to find somewhere to put these guys. And there we go. That's what we got. Unfortunately, no team of the years as of yet. Apart from the lone Messi and the lone Mbappe from the objectives and the team things. So... We'll leave it there. There's nothing else new to talk about. The main thing is the Lucas Paqueta um, flashback card and the 80, 11 times 81 plus attacker SPC. Those are the only real bits of content today. Nice and brief, nice and short. Looks like that's all that's there for today. Um, hopefully tomorrow, Sunday, we'll bring some more. There'll be another video around 6 o'clock then. I uh, hope you've had a nice Saturday and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.